Hi, this is Tony from Fashion Studio 7 Magazine. We're here today at Claire Point Place Banquet Hall with the Canadian Tamil Youth Alliance presenting their third annual Top Talents Awards Gala and Dinner. So we're here today with Anojani from CTYA. Would you mind telling us a little bit about this event? Sure. Um, so the CTYA is also known as the Canadian Tamil Youth Alliance. We practically have five councils, um, starting from the Arts and Culture Council to the Education Council, the Athletics Council, um, the Tamil Nation Development Council, and so forth. And we hold events and um, create platforms where youth can put their talents into these councils and shine in our society, so where they have an area to show what they're made out of. Awards are um, given to Tamil youth who have shown great achievement in specific fields in society, so arts, academics, um, sports. What would you say is the biggest award here to be won? Well, um, I think they're all on the same um, platform here because um, there is no hierarchy in CTYA. I mean, like everyone's worthy of their own achievements. But however, we are introducing a very, very, very special award this year, and it's called the Ula Vahe Award. Well, that's in Tamil, and it means um, young, um, like young sprouts or young achievements. That's a, like the best achievement that a youth can do in any field. So it doesn't have to be like an art. It doesn't have to be in athletics, but when a youth achieves something that's like considered to be a lifetime achievement, that's when the award is given. And we're introducing that award this year. So we're here with Herania. Okay, Herania, now you look familiar. You had an interview with us from SAC and you also volunteer here. Now, can you tell us about your volunteer positions with both places? Um, at SAC, I'm just a general volunteer. I work with um, uh, mostly the adult kids because I'm well trained with them. And at here, I'm just doing some journal admissions and backstage performance coordination stuff. Here, what can we see from tonight? Well, this is actually a great recognition and an appreciation for Canadian Tamil youth because we know a lot of the Canadian talent, they're like all the YouTubers and sports teams, everyone, they do not get as much appreciation from our community. We want to uplift the talent and we want to bring out all these talents so the world can see who we are and how much talent they have. My name is uh, Ramana. I'm an uh, education and career development um, director. And for this event, that's a good question. Right now, I'm just doing security. Uh, leading up to this thing, the selling of tickets. So we're here today with the directors of this event. Now, can you tell me what a little bit about what we should expect and what we're going to see and who's important in this event? Um, we're going to see a lot of local uh, Tamil um, youth in our community which are doing a lot of wonderful things. Uh, such YouTube stars as uh, Boy Wonder, uh, that's correct. And we have uh, a couple local uh, musicians and artists which are going to be performing. So over here we have Thermia. Thermia. Now Thermia, could you tell us what you do? Yeah, I'm a board of director of Arts and Culture Council and um, what I do is I recruit the talent in our local community. What can we expect to see here tonight? Tonight, it's not the problem. Today, tonight is Top Talents, where we are bringing in a lot of new faces with amazing talents, and we're hoping to give them a venue and get recognized for what they do and shine brighter in the greater Toronto area as well. Hello, everyone. We're here today with Ken Karupa. Now, Ken, can you tell us what you do? I am a real estate agent by profession, but I am a politician now, uh, trying to run for the uh, PC party of Ontario for the uh, upcoming provincial election. Can you shed your opinion about uh, the Tamil youth and their involvement for today? Oh yes, this today's event is uh, done by the Canadian Tamil um, Youth Association, it's, uh, it's called Top Talents. Uh, this association is a great association, there are so many um, youths are involved. YouTube sensation, Anujan. Now Anujan, can you tell us a little bit about of your YouTube channel? Well basically I just talk about like um, topics that relate to like the South Asian community, so like different stuff that they do, and I just poke fun at them, right? So uh, yeah, that's basically it. So you make fun of your own culture now. Tell me, yeah. how does that work out in favor for you? Well, I I make fun of it, but like at the same time, like you know, I, I raise like different issues as well that happen in our community. So even th like, I have my funny videos and I have my like, much more serious videos. So we're here today with the Honorable Brad Gudeep. Now, could you tell us? What is your ministry about? I'm the Minister of Economic Development and Innovation for the province of Ontario. Now could you break that down a little further for those who don't know what that is? 
Well, my job is really to help grow the economy, uh, to help make our economy stronger, uh, to ensure that we pass on to the next generation of Ontarians a strong, growing economy. Are you presenting any awards tonight? I'll have the honor of presenting, I believe, the Visual Arts Award tonight. So I'm looking forward to doing that. It's all about building a more innovative future for our young people. I've been involved with the Tamil community for about well, 20 years now, and I've watched it uh, grow from a small group now very significant population it's a growing community it's it's a vibrant community and you just look at the talent of that young population and you know the Tamil community of the future is in Ontario is going to be very very strong so we thank Brad for coming out today stay tuned we have more to come